Hey guys, welcome back to Splashdown Rides Gone Wild. For one final video, one bonus video, showing up, showing off a couple of the extra unlockables and a couple things you can buy. But first, some housekeeping. A, a long time ago, back when I played Jet X20, which I guess wasn't that long ago, but like a year or so, a guy named Hool posted to GameFAQs with a thread called, I'm holding Incetic 47 to his pledge to make a fac, with the message, I'm sure he'll ever read this. Well, Hool, because I'm a very vain man, I frequently Google myself, and I finally saw your forum thread, so I'm probably not gonna make a fac for that game. I mean, you just pull sick tricks, get fucking ripped. You're gonna have to do a little better to don't hold him to his word. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna have to try a little harder, buddy. Yeah, yeah. But uh, but I did read it, so good job on you. Anyway, with us for this, last, you. Uh, for this last video, we've got Intelligent Calcium. Great, great, great. And as far as bonus videos go, we decided, you know what? Screw it. Let's just let's just read some bad fanfic. That's yeah. what everyone else does. We went and I went in search of Splashdown fanfic, but of no. course couldn't find anything. However, Intelligent Calcium, two of us, a couple other guys, we play Borderlands, we play Minecraft, so we had a lot of material to search for. So we've got a couple things to read for you guys, some short things, and also some things in the video that'll try to mention. So, um... So basically you're gonna try to break up the flow. Yes, we've yes. Already, we're trying to build right. up. So, make us feel like... which story do we want to start with? Uh, I see. Borderlands? Minecraft? I, we can start with my back story. You know? I think that would be a good one to start on. Okay. Um... Uh, so, so let's blow that up. Okay. Uh, Alright then, uh, Calcium did you- okay. This is my back story. Lunar. Yeah. Oh, who's going to read those? I didn't know who was going to read you, I thought you were- Oh, no, wait, we're the narrator and you're the Oh, okay. Characters. Okay, so- I can be Foxy if you want. <laughs> okay, yeah, why don't you do that? Okay. okay. Lunar. Mom, can me and Foxy go out and play, please? I said, all right, you two have helped a lot with me having a new leader coming. <laughs> Are you sure you'll be fine? Yes, go have some fun. I'll be here when you get back. After we left, we ran all the way to the edge of our territory. We didn't know what that there was a bed of catnip. <laughs> we changed into cats to have fun in the patch. Foxy. Lunar and I were having so much, <laughs> we heard A and Sis jumped behind some grass and pecked throw and stared where we heard the noise. I'd say that effectively yeah, yeah, covered yeah, yeah. the backstory of... I mean, the, 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 the description is this is Tavia's backstory. No, this is the Tavia's. This is the Tavia's backstory. If you want to read the main story, go to Kingdom Lover 123123. And can I just say, that totally had a lot to do with Minecraft. <laughs> yes. Yeah. All right. That's a Minecraft thing. I guess while we're on the subject of Minecraft, Blank Tester, there's one that oh, you want to read. Yeah, I wanted to read um, <clears throat> the burning. And uh, the description reads: One shot made recently from a thought I had when I was trying to sleep, made in about 30 minutes, like a kick. Yeah. <clears throat> This literally just appeared in my head when I was trying to sleep. That's, I guess, the author's note. It's in bold. <clears throat> there was a fire. A massive fire, quickly consuming the world. The screams of citizens and mobs were everywhere. <laughs> a creeper family trying to escape <laughs> Only to trip and be consumed by the flames. Village set alight. The children screaming in pain. Children? One village left standing, a man on a hill opposite the fire staring, watching all the pain and suffering, resigned to his fate. Meanwhile! <laughs> okay, that was a fun world, but it was getting a bit boring. I guess I'll delete it and make a new one. The first few nights are the most fun anyway. End quote. Yeah. So he's got that marked tragedy slash humor. I failed to see where the humor Interesting combination. Was. Rated M. Alright, the writing style was a tragedy, but I'm sure. Yeah. Think I should do this or should we move oh. to Borderlands? Uh, I think we should. 
Well, how, what time is it? Uh, what time we got? We got a lot like five minutes in. Uh, you can do this. Minecraft ad. All right. Then I've got one Minecraft story for you guys. It's called Minecraft Ad, not so mob talker yet. That's that is you didn't he didn't miss say that no. and you didn't miss hear it. That's right. Minecraft Ad, not so mob talker right. yet. Guys, this is my first novel. Hope you like it. We wouldn't be talking on this part, but it would be more focused on Steve that on the mobs. Well, let's start waking on Minecraft. I was on school on a normal day, and I don't know how I ended up here. It was not a dream because I could touch and destroy things, and I knew where I was Minecraft. Lucky, luckily, I was alone, or I thought that, so they could kill me. I started like a normal Minecraft game. I started oh wait, wait, um, is that a colon or a period? Uh, colon. Okay, good. No period. So I started like a normal Minecraft game. I started punching tree blocks and <coughs> popping them. <coughs> Audi was walking around wondering how do I get there until I saw someone. He was a green hooded man with black hair. I didn't knew who he was, and I didn't were going to ask him. <laughs> I ran as fast as I could to hide on the wood because I afraid if he could kill me. First period. He finally get out of my sight and I relaxed. I thought what they could actually be and I paralyzed, realizing <laughs> that he could be a creeper by remembering the photos of the mob talker just two days ago. <laughs> I made a wooden pickaxe to get straining on the mine. I was always a great miner, so I did I to get problems to got some stone and coal, <laughs> but theirs was a real problem. NIGHT! Just if I could remember on night, every mob appear in the world, so I was totally freaked out. Still, there was another problem. Got no wool equals no bed equals no sleep. I was going out the mine to get some, but there was it. Night. That night was the worst one ever. I saw every kind of mob. Creepers, zombies, skeletons, spiders, and a couple of endermans. If I could decided what I was more scared, it would be the endermen that mobs could teleport to your back and backstab you. <laughs> Next morning I woke up. I think I just suddenly sleep because I don't remember a lot and my head hurts. I couldn't believe where I slept. On the stairs of my mind. My back felt terrible and I didn't feel even rested, but it was day and well that's good, isn't it? Luckily I could find some sheep and kill them to get wool and I started building my house. I was going to start it, but I felt someone sawing me. Oh god. I tumble my head to saw who it was, who was seeing me, but nothing. This is the end of the first chapter. Hope you like it, and I will continue when I have time. Uh, ah, yes, when I finish this one, I would make another one of Pokemon White. And that's the first chapter of Seven of Minecraft Ad. Not so mob talker, talker yet. <sighs> oh, and it was anyway, updated an hour ago. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I. Th I think we've got time for one short one, so if we move over to Borderlands really quickly, I think we've got something for you guys. Uh, uh, all right, let uh, me uh, let me get my uh, nerdy cousin in on this one. Let me uh, where are you? Uh, hey, hey, Boing Dexter, come over here. I got something for you to read. What do you need me to read? Uh. <laughs> 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 oh, I dropped into the voice too soon. Um. <laughs> 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 oh wait, no, that's not even the voice I was going to use. Like, hey, I'm from Jersey. I'm talking about a necromancer. No. All right, all right, we've got like a minute. So. Okay, here is a necromancer poem of sorts. It is just a poem I wrote in school about the necromancer. Are you guys ready? Cause here we go. Here yeah, we go. I'm ready. I'm ready. <clears throat> hey, can I get a bongo beat? Uh, pa -pa 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 -pa. Pa -pa -pa -pa. You summon you robot and build up anarchy. You boil people like in a pot. All the wrong point, no, all the point in the wrong skill tree. <laughs> they are all dead, but don't dismay. You pull out your favorite gun. More of your friends have come to play. This will be a lot of fun. I love it, I love it, I love it. 10 out of 10, you get, bang. An, you get an A. I thought that you had more, a. um, more misspellings in it, but I guess, uh... It's beautiful uh, the way it is. Like, yeah. Comparatively, that has very few misspellings and grammar errors. Comparatively. Yeah. Yeah. Comparatively. Relative. Relative. 
So, what's going on in Splashdown? Alright. Let's get back to the real world. Really bad compression <laughs> is what I'm seeing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay? I, I, I must have sent the 2P file again. I keep doing that. Anyway, we've... We've gone. We've shown off quite a few things. First, we started with the freestyle tracks, which are you know the tricking only. And as you saw, those got pretty crazy. And then we went to the time trials, and we bought a whole bunch of tracks. And you saw them getting more complicated as we moved on from like little challenges to races to circuits and stuff and such and such. I guess I do say and such. Yeah, you do. We've got one extra final present for you guys, so we're switching back to Amon Ra. Why are we switching back to Amon Ra? We, you know, he's switching back to that speedo that you guys loved so well. Um, it is disturbingly and, you know, defined eight pack. You guys are. And you know, we're bumping everything up. We're setting it on the highest type of wave. You know, the choppiest waves, the highest difficulty, the AI is to choppiest opponents. waves, choppiest graphics, yeah, yeah. choppiest sound. Yeah. Uh, you got. Uh, 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 you got uh, uh, and. Uh, and you may have noticed that I bought one mystery song from the options oh, no. quite oh, a while no. ago. And <sighs> so going into the music track and, you know, switching through the soundtrack so you guys can see the actual songs that were in the game. Oh, no! Whoa, wait, what was that called? The Ancient King of... Ancient King of Bling, baby. Oh, fuck. You think you've got enough, no. Amin-Ra? Uh, yeah. So, uh, I'm gonna mute... Oh. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. Okay, got I'm gonna. <laughs> All right, I, I'm gonna leave the three of us to this, and I'm just gonna let this roll. This is the ending that Splashdown Rides by Wild deserves. Um, those were words. That was certainly a thing. That was a oh, thing God. that you Amin exposed Ra, us to. <sighs> I feel like exposed is exactly the right word. That, uh, well, I feel violated somehow. Yeah. Splashdown Rides Gone Wild. It was surprisingly good, or at least surprisingly decent, and surprisingly full of our boy Amon Ra. Will he ever, will he ever reach the fame he deserves?
No. Will he ever get more than a shout out in a Jamie the D video? No. Will he ever reach the top of the pop charts like no. he wants to? Will he ever work his way into your heart? That was seriously some racist shit. <laughs> I, I I mentioned this, but I'm pretty sure he's been racist from the beginning. From the beginning, yeah. I'm pretty sure. Go back to Splashdown One, whichever video I picked him. I'm pretty sure the first words out of your mouth were, "Wow, that is some racist shit." That wouldn't surprise me. He uh. is like an ultra racist character. Yeah. I mean, I guess he could be in like blackface. That would be worse, <laughs> but like. It's still really bad. That's that was not an Egyptian accent. It's a stereotype. It's a stereotype in a game full of stereotypes. It was that 2000. Was, it was the 90s or it, 2000s oh, uh, or whatever. Why do you keep thinking that these games were released in the 90s? Because they're old as fuck and stupid as fuck, and they think racism is Man, cool. Man, 3D didn't even exist until the PS2 came along. That's not true. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Play your video games. Play your PS1. You have PS1 games that you've played for this thread! This video brought to you by Ballin' Bob Loblaws, Lobable Ballistic, Lollin' Lobster Blog, Loblog. Get yours today.